Hello, my dear friend. Welcome to the Voice of Hope with your servant, Pastor Isaac Apple. Today, I want us to continue with our series on why Christians suffer. So far, we have looked at two reasons why, two possible reasons why many Christians suffer. The first one was lack of knowledge. The second one was disobedience. Today, we are looking at the third reason, and that reason is many Christians go through difficult times because God wants to purify and test our faith. According to the Bible, in 1 Peter chapter 1, reading from verses 6 to verse 7, the Bible makes us understand that suffering is not always as a result of lack of knowledge or disobedience, but it can also be as a result that God wants to purify your faith. Listen to what the Bible says. It says, In all this you greatly rejoice, though now for a little while you may have had to suffer grief in all kinds of trials. These have come so that the proving genuineness of your faith of greater worth than gold, which perishes even though refined with fire, may result in praise, glory, when Jesus Christ is revealed. This is so amazing. This is what the Apostle Peter is telling us. The reason why many Christians suffer is because God wants to test the genuineness of your faith. You see, the only way you can actually get gold is when the raw material is passed through fire. The gold will be left shining. When we go through the fire, when we go through the difficulties, when we go through the temptations, when we go through the brokenness, our faith is passing through the fire of God's refinery and we are going to come out to bring praise to the Most High God. In the same way, the Apostle James, in James chapter 1, verses 2 to verse 4, says that consider it pure joy, my brothers and sisters, whenever you face trials of many kinds, because you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance. Let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. So in order for you to have that breakthrough, there must be a wall to break through. You cannot experience breakthrough when there is no obstacle before you. But the good news is, God only allows that level of temptation, that level of trials, that level of difficulties according to the measure of the faith that we have. So no temptation will come upon you that is so big or difficult that you cannot overcome. So my dear friend, if you are doing everything as a good Christian, yet going through difficult times, Maybe God is testing the genuineness of your faith. Job was able to stand, though he lost more than any of us have lost in our lives. Stand for him. And in the end, Bible says, you will be mature and you will lack nothing. And your life will bring honor, praise and glory to the name of the Most High God. Father, I pray for anyone, any child of yours who is going through serious problems today. I pray for that mother who has lost all her children because of her faith in you. I pray for that father who is going through difficult times because he has decided to stand for you. Grant us all the strength that we need that we will stand and remain faithful to the end and bring glory to your name. In Jesus Christ's name, Amen.